Patty, and, she, and one of the girls I knew, you know, she knew some boys, and one of them was John. Yeah. So he came in that that night that my grandmother said I could have a party at the house. You yeah. Know? <laughs> so that's so, what the, that that was the best part of the sixteenth. Yeah, party. and then I said when I met his mother, uh, she was just wonderful. Yeah. You know? And uh, I mean, I I I say to Sister Barbara because she was the she was only six years old then when I first met her. Oh wow. You know, and I was sixteen. Yeah. Wow. But I said, uh, you know, when she put her arms around me, and I said, you know, when I look back at Sister Barbara, you know, I'm really taking the breadwinner from your mother, and yet she put her arms around me because John, he used to go to school during the day and yeah. then work all night at South Station, taking mail off the trains and go to school the next day. Oh my goodness. And then his father was more or less sick all the time with phlebitis. Yeah. But I said, you know, uh, yet she was happy to meet me and, you know, from then on, you know, she changed my life completely. That's great. I mean, you know, it's good, you know, you were part of the family and she accepted you and, oh. Yeah. So, uh, Sister Barbara will always say, when you walked in, you changed our whole life. You know, it was uh, altogether different. You would always come in with high heels and so stockings, and my father would look at you like, and I wore nail polish and lipstick, you know, mm -hmm. and all this. <laughs> and I was a, a whole different thing to that house. Yeah. <laughs> Aww, that's... Now, how old were you when you got married? 21. Oh, all right. Oh, so you were young. Yeah. Yeah, John, uh, well, he wasn't here for his graduation. Uh, at that time, in 1945, uh, you could get out of school early if you were on the honor roll and go into the service. Oh. Because you were going to be drafted anyway when you would be, you yeah. know, 18. You know, and he was eight, eight, almost 18, you know, in his last year of high school. Yeah. So he got out of uh, Boston Tech in January. Oh, wow. And he went into the Army. He was going for, uh, well, uh, he served two years. One year he was in Maryland, and then the other year he was in Germany. Oh, wow. But then when he came back, he wanted to get married, and uh, <laughs> the Bible said, you could hear him crying in, in the bed. He wanted to get married. Mother said, no, wait until you're 21, you know. Oh, so she made him wait. Wow. But I tell Johnny that, and John says, man, I can see if you're telling the kids today. They say, you're kidding, man, I'm going to mm -hmm. do it anyway, you know? I mean, at that time, you just <clears throat> did what the adults said. It, it, was, it was different. People had respect for people back yeah, then. Yeah, if, 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 if John's mother said something, you would never, uh, or, you know, my, yeah, you my, followed aunt, it. Or my grandmother or my aunt, you know, there was no question. You just accepted it. Yeah. How did, how did Dad propose to you? Or did he? Did he get down on one knee and <laughs> present yeah. you with a diamond? Uh... <laughs> no, uh, for Valentine's Day when he came, you know, came uh, out of the service, uh, he was twenty, and I remember this Valentine's Day. I was thinking about he gave me a friendship ring, you know, that was oh. the first thing, and then he gave me a locket, you know, with his, his picture inside. <laughs> how old? How old were you then? How many years? How many? I'm trying to figure out the timeline. So you'd be probably about 20? Well, it's about uh, 20 then. 20, yeah. yeah. Then we got married the next year. So that was his proposal? You, well, was there any uh, sort of... Uh, you know, we just knew we were going to get married. Oh, uh, it wasn't the way. That wasn't how it worked back then. There was no big, uh -huh. produ there was no big production back in those days. <laughs> no, 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 you're getting down on your knees. No. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but we were married 42 years. Now, you were married 42 years, but you were with him from the point when you were... Five just... years before you. Wow. So that's... 47 years, yeah. Oh, bless you. Yeah. Wow. He died at... Uh, was it? One month before his 64th birthday, I think it was. Wow. But when, you know, about John, like, you know, well, uh, well we were talking about Johnny Mews, you know, that... He lived down on Beach Street. He was married to my sister who just died. You mm -hmm. know? And, you know, he, he, like Luke was saying, you know, he was 75 when he died. And uh, he was like a go-getter. He worked for the uh, MBTA. And then he 
uh, retired from there, and then he ran a, a taxi, you mm -hmm. know, his own car. He didn't, <laughs> he didn't, you know, whatever money he got. He was, yeah. uh, uh, oh boy, you know, I mean, he was, he was like day and night, but uh, Big John was crazy about him, really. Yeah. You know? I mean, they, they were different. John would get money and put it in his pocket where John did had to report it to the